What is going on, Planet Poke? Jay here, and I am bringing you guys um, what you guys wanted. You guys wanted uh, to see the rest of N's um, weather teams or whatever, or his um, season seasonal teams. Uh, let me say it like that because that's pretty much what it is. So first up, we have his spring team. I want to say spring. Yes, yeah, spring because it's Politoed. And you're going to notice that I sped it up uh, quite a bit. Also, you probably already noticed that um, the audio quality is a lot different in terms of my commentary. That's because I got a new microphone and I got a pop filter for it. So, um, you know, yeah, it works it works really well. It's a blue snowball. So, you know, it was pre it was it, it's just awesome. I just love it so much. Um, so what else is there? So first, we're going to have a uh, spring team. Then we're gonna battle his summer team, and then we're gonna battle his. Oh, we I battle his uh, autumn or fall team, and uh, they weren't really too tough of teams to take on, but um, yeah. So um, what I plan on doing with the PWT is, excuse me, I'm going to um, make it separate from the uh, playthrough just because I don't know. I mean. It's, I, mean, I don't know, I mean, it's just, I don't, I don't know why I want to make it separate from the, um, from the, um, see, from the playthrough, but I'm just going to do it. Hopefully no one will get mad at me or anything. Uh, this is just going to be a little extra part since I don't necessarily have to do this part, but you know, I wanted to, and you guys wanted me to, so I'm doing it, but yeah, so, um, I don't really know what else to say there. Uh, I guess just stay tuned for some uh, PWT. Um, I know in the PWT there is the Unova League. There's the Unova Leaders, the Kanto, Johto, Ho, and Sinnoh Leaders. Then there's like the World Leaders, which is like everybody. And then there's the Champions. So I'm, I'm probably going to do... I know I'm going to do the Unova, Kanto, Johto... Hoenn, Sinnoh, and I'm going to do the champions, so that should be six, um, six times, well, actually I'm going to do the PWT like a lot of times, but in order to get to the champions, but I'm going to have to do, I'm going to do, there's probably going to be six more videos after this one, and then, uh, that's pretty much it, that's pretty, I mean, school, I mean, school is not letting me do anything like right now honestly so uh, it's pretty unfortunate but um, I don't know I guess like my time on Planet Poke is uh, almost up just because I've been on here since like summer of 2012 yeah 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 summer of 2012 I do believe so yeah it's been <laughs> it's been a while and um, oh look we defeated his uh, spring team uh, now here's his summer team, and uh, I hate that Nine Tails. By the way, can't stand it. Oh yeah, did you guys see that new EV evolution in uh, Pokemon X and Y? Um, what are your, what are you guys, what are your, your thoughts on like the type that it is? Like when I first saw it, I got a flying type vibe from it, and then like I looked at the colors, and I was like, okay, maybe it's dragon because you know red and blue sort of symbolizes dragon. A little bit from what I I think it symbolizes dragon a little bit, but it's like, I mean, even for Eevee evolution, it's just way too like you know cute to be like a dragon type in my opinion. So I don't know. I'm thinking maybe it's flying. Uh, it doesn't look like fighting. It doesn't look like rock, ground, poison, ghost, steel. It doesn't look like any of those. So. I don't know. Some people were saying it's probably like a new type, which I can I can definitely see it if it is a new type. Um, some people were saying it's normal. I'm like, uh, I don't see why they would even like why why have a normal type evolution of Eevee? I mean, well, then again, that would be pretty cool. But why would why would it look like that though? I mean, I would think it would look like like a much bigger version of Eevee or something, you know. But I don't know. Maybe it's a new type. I'm not sh I'm not too sure um, but what are you guys thoughts I think it's just I think it's flying or dragon and if not those it's definitely a new type because it can't be anything else there's just no dang gone way there is just no way 
or maybe it's a combination of like fire and water or some crazy crazy shenanigan crap i don't even know pokemon x and y they're just doing a lot they're doing way too much i mean don't get me wrong i'm excited about the games and everything but but like releasing six gen this early is just ridiculous i i find this to be really early because they released black two and white two in the summer uh last summer and then they announced uh x and y at the beginning of the year or whatever so i don't understand why they brought out six gen like just like that you know i don't i don't understand this is ridiculous i thought they was going to do uh ruby sapphire remakes that would have been pretty cool but they didn't do that they just decided hey let's go ahead and just bring out six gen because that's what we want to do you know i'm like okay whatever do what you want game freak i mean i'm gonna have to buy the game anyway because you know you know you know me i buy all pokemon games and stuff well not all games i just buy like the rpg well just these these kind of games i don't do the mystery the mystery dungeon or um like the other ones but i do do um you know po the versions like you know red blue yellow and whatever mm. and uh yeah who are we oh okay we're still on this we're still on his summer team like dang could have sworn like I just dis destroyed it. Like I'm, I'm, I've been talking for like six minutes. Actually, I can't tell if it's actually six minutes. Yeah, it is six minutes. Like six minutes and thirty some forty seconds. Uh, but uh, yeah. So, how's it going? I really didn't have anything planned. To I didn't have anything to talk about because you know I haven't done post commentary on anything in a while. And usually when I do post commentary on anything, it's like a Wi-Fi battle and I don't really Wi-Fi battle anymore. So it's kind of tough just doing random commentary, you know what I mean? But, um, yeah, um, what else, what else is there to talk about? Oh yeah, I gotta buy, I have to buy a 3DS in order to play Pokemon X and Y, um, for those who are wondering which one I'm getting, I am definitely getting Pokemon Y just because, you know, Pokemon Y is amazing. The legendary looks pretty legit, so I'm going to get that one. And I'm, I plan on getting a uh, red 3DS. Can't believe I got to buy a 3DS. I, I'm so mad. Like, like even, I mean, if it was the Ruby Sapphire remake, I, I don't know. I, I'm, I'm just disappointed I have to buy a 3DS. That's more money I have to drop on a handheld that I don't even I don't even want the handheld. That's the thing. I just want it. I just have to. Ha I have to have it for the game though. So kind of sucks. But um, uh, wow. I still haven't beat. Oh wait, this is his last Pokemon in his uh for his summer team. Don't know why he has a Ninjask on his summer team. Kind of weird, if you ask me. Um, just because he's pretty much setting himself up to get smashed but I will say that Game Freak has definitely thought about their move sets and stuff because like you know in third gen they probably wouldn't even have protect or anything when they first came out or whatever but now like fifth gen they just they like made their teams so much more I don't I don't know what to say I don't know how to say it like their teams are more strategically put together you know like I'm not. I'm. I don't. I don't know how to say it. I mean, it's just their move sets are so much better. They complement the Pokemon's actual skill. Like, look at that Stealth Rock. Like, I honestly think that Game Freak started looking at like competitive battlers and started looking at competitive uh, teams and stuff and move sets, and they just based the in-game teams off of that for the strong trainers anyway. All like the gym leaders and stuff. Their their moves suck. I don't really care about them. But like the strong trainers, like like in and stuff they definitely thought over um the teams and everything so i think i think that was really cool um really create not creative but really smart of them to do because it makes the game a little bit more challenging i mean not necessarily not necessarily challenging just because they're not like ev trained or anything and they don't do the whole prediction uh shenanigan and stuff but i will say um game freak has definitely improved on the move sets and they um they just did a good job and my phone made a noise okay i don't care about that and um 
yeah also how does this how does this microphone sound anyway does it sound good bad in between I don't know I mean I'm kind of holding it up to my mouth and it's like with the pop filter and it looks really weird but I don't I don't know I mean it's something I got to get used to but um I keep on sucking my teeth and I keep on saying um because I don't really know what else to say just because I mean 10 minutes well, actually, I think it's 11 minutes. This video is like 11 or 12 minutes, so I have a little bit more time to talk. I don't have anything to talk about, though. It kind of sucks. No! But, um... Damn it, I said but, um, again. Dang! Stop it! Stop it, Jay. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Oh, yeah. Friends in real life are now starting to subscribe to my YouTube channel, which is not really a good thing because I try to keep my social life and... Well, what little of a social life I do have in my YouTube life separately, but no, it doesn't really work out that way. Like, two of my friends follow me on Twitter, and it's like, uh, I'm not really comfortable with that. And then, like, she told me, like, she came up here and she told me that she, like, watches my videos for, like, 30 seconds, and then she uh, exits the uh, tab. I'm like, thank you for exiting the tab. And she's like, oh, we should watch one of Javon's videos let's go I was like no you're not gonna watch any of my videos stop <laughs> so um, yeah I don't know they're crazy anyway um, I think this is the end because he brought out his scissor and I just take it out with a flame charge for my inboard so uh, thank you guys for watching um, don't forget to leave a like comment subscribe to Planet Pokey uh, come check me out if you want to and I will be back with the PWT